Hi Water Signs, my name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you your general weekly message for uh, June 24th into the 30th, 2019. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading, so if you are interested in a private one, all the information is down below in the description box. So I will be putting the timestamps in the description box as well uh, to help you guys out. We are going to start off first for the sign of Scorpio. I uh, hope guy, you guys are doing well. Uh, quite an interesting energy here, okay? This is all about balance, uh, patience, big time here, okay? You first start off with the temperance card. So this is Sagittarius energy, so you could be dealing with Sag here. But for the overall energy, I feel that you've been more than patient in regards to receiving some type of love here with the Four of Cups. I feel that with your thoughts and the slowness of the situation, you have the Devil card here. That's kind of toxic energy because, rightfully so, uh, because of that Knight of Pentacles. The Knight is a slow pace, and out of the four elements, the Pentacle is too. But the Pentacle also represents the balance of the situation. His energy is literally turned looking, that Devil energy is turned looking at the slowness of the situation. Because right after that, and what's wild is, that horse is trotting on over to that Nine of Pentacles. More Pentacles, more balance here needed, I feel. Okay, What this tells me is that You've been trying to be patient in regards to receiving that cup of love, but you haven't been feeling it, okay? You're analyzing the situation, kind of getting a little toxic, I feel, with the balance of your own life here because you've been waiting quite some time with that nine. You need that ten for that completion. It's coming, okay? But what I feel for this week's messages for you guys is you have the tower card. So you're having this abrupt moment, okay? You're not having... You're, uh, you're not sporting the goods in regards to having that calm moment of your life, all right? I feel with the clarifier, you're in the dark about things, don't know which way to go. This chick always makes me feel a little dizzy feeling as well. It's kind of like, which way do I look for this, okay? I feel that you're having this tower moment here in the dark about things. And it was wild because you could be dealing with fire here with this, five, with this uh, king of wands here, Leo, Aries, or Sag. But when I put the card down, I literally felt numb. Uh, and they brought up my mom. Uh, I don't know why they bring up my personal life. <laughs> but they brought up my mom. My mom had uh, brain, ca brain cancer, okay? And she would get, uh, uh, I hate getting personal, but uh, she would have seizures, right? And uh, because of that. Uh, and I remember I, I wasn't allowed to go outside my bedroom this one time, right? Because she was in the middle of having one. And my dad freaked on me and told me to get back in my room. But from what I remember seeing, I remember the ambulance, uh, you know, uh, guy, the, you know, I can't think of the name. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, he was going like this. And my dad was snapping his fingers to get my mom out of that state of mind, you know, that the seizure, right? Trying to get her out of it. Okay. I, I was really young. I was like 12 or 11. I didn't know what was going on at that time, you know? So that's that feeling she had that look of numbness to her face okay that's what i feel it's kind of like statue mode i don't know where i'm going i don't know what i'm doing kind of lost energy of that numbness here clarifying that is the four of swords sorry i didn't mean to get personal but that's what they were showing me in my mind here swords is a mental anguish here trying to heal the situation trying to calm the mind okay in regards to, this is quite complicated, Scorpio, I got to say, you have been more than patient to receive this cup of love, okay? You're analyzing the situation, not the greatest energy with that devil card, literally turned waiting for this balance of your life again, okay? Having that tower moment, don't know which way to go here, kind of feeling numb, trying to snap out of it. Maybe that's why they were showing me the snapping, okay? Uh, and I feel that you need to not to put it, but just to go with that story energy here, kind of snap out of it, okay, in regards to the toxicity, in regards to that slowness, believe me, I'm not judging nobody, I've been there, I've been there done that, you know, I get that energy, absolutely, but I feel for this week's message, seriously, is try to snap out of that numbness, I know it's a lot easier said than done, but Try your hardest to calm the mind in regards to this slowness, in regards to your thoughts here. I feel that somebody is definitely numb feeling. It's kind of like statue mode. 
you know, I'm just staring off in space, I can't figure my life out kind of thing, calm, okay? Be patient with not just the situation of trying to get that balance in regards to this love offer that I feel that somebody wants to receive but is not receiving it here, and just calm your mind and relax, okay? That's what I have for the sign of Scorpio. I know that was a little tough and rough there, but especially with them bringing that up in my past. But yeah, that's what they show me. They show me these past stories of my life. And that's one of them I don't really want to remember. <laughs> so with that being said, let's move on to the sign of Pisces. Uh, let's take the time here. 544. 544 for the sign of Pisces. Hope you guys are doing well here. You also start off, whomever this is meant for, for the devil card here. What in the world? <laughs> uh, the devil card is that toxicity here. Uh, but it's kind of like, thank goodness you changed that energy. Uh, they're showing me a uh, crossing guard. And they have that sign that is uh, bringing up kind of thing with the stop sign in their hand kind of thing. And they're holding it up. So it's kind of like you're putting a stop to that toxicity of your life here. Because you got the... Ten of Pentacles here, you're uh, getting that completion in regards to total balance of your life in regards to a relationship here with the higher font, okay? Major arcana, all right, that commitment. And you're going to be calming your mind. Similar energies as well, but I feel it's kind of like if you haven't checked out Scorpio and you have Scorpio in your chart, you're dealing with a Scorpio, definitely check this out. A lot of similar energies here. It's kind of like, but Pisces is more like like two steps ahead of Scorpio. I, I hate to say it like that, but that's what I'm feeling here. It's kind of like you have decided to put a stop to the toxicity of a situation in regards to a relationship here, and you're going to get that bounce back in to be able to heal the mind and calm the mind, I feel, okay? Because you're getting out of that slump, okay? With that five of pentacles, that's what it all is. With that pentacle, get again, all right? Especially with the five, fives are known for that change. Because uh, you have not been overly happy, okay, in regards to the balance of your life here. But you're holding that pentacle, and you're going to have that change, I feel, uh, for the sign of Pisces here. Uh, been a long time coming, but I do feel that there is going to be some type of communication uh, with these two knights here literally charging at each other. Uh, you know, seriously, with that devil card here and all these pentacles here and the four of swords, Somebody could definitely be coming back after quite some time, but you know, I always go with what I'm feeling here. What I'm feeling here is kind of like enough is enough already. You know, I'm putting a pause on the toxicity of the situation in regards to this relationship. I'm calm in the mind. It's kind of like he's holding that sword and realizing, hey, I need to have balance in my life is what that's saying. After quite some time, I feel it's kind of like an aha moment of I got to have a change. That's what I'm feeling here in the sign of Pisces. And I hope that that helped, guys. Good for you. Everybody deserves balance. Everybody has to have that aha moment in their life at times to be able to calm their mind over a situation in regards to something that was toxic. I feel you're now regaining that balance back in and calming the mind, healing the mind, having that change, coming out of that slump after quite some time, and getting that balance back into your life again. And that's what I have for the sign of Pisces. Let's do the sign of Cancer here. Let me write down the time here for Cancer. 8.48 for Cancer. All right. Hope you guys are doing well for the sign of Cancer. Uh, interesting. Very, very interesting here. You have the Eight of Pentacles, the Lover's Card, the Four of Swords, the Nine of Cups, and the uh, Ace of Wands. With the outcome of the Knight of Cups and the Ace of Pentacles. Okay. Nice. <laughs> That's what I say. Uh, Eight of Pentacles is known for putting in this work. It's literally facing the Lover's card. This is Gemini energy. does not have to be. It is part of that twin flame as well. And to have two Aces, regardless if it's in your spread or your outcome or clarifier, that, I take that literally. That's the 11 here. That's a divinely guided number. So these two cards tells me is that there will be work put in in regards to possibly a twin flame relationship here, but more so in regards to putting in that work in regards to a decision that is going to be made in regards to uh, four swords. This baby's been popping out for all the water signs today. Uh, 
definitely that is going to be calming the mind because I feel that somebody out there is definitely getting their wish fulfillment with the Nine of Cups and is going to start a new beginning, a very fiery, very passionate with the Ace of Wands here. Whole new start here. Yeah, it's taken a long time. Hello, Twin Flame. Uh, the Knight of Cups here is that slowness, but look at his energy literally turned. Even the hand is being given that new beginning in regards to that balance with that pentacle. So what this tells me, Cancer, is that there will be now work. Okay. Sorry, they were talking. They are saying to add the Eight of Pentacles with the Ace of Pentacles. That's Nine of Pentacles. Somebody's been seriously waiting for quite some time because to get that completion would be the 10 here. So this has been a long journey here for somebody, but I do feel that somebody is now going to be coming in after quite some time to offer that new beginning. Very fiery, very passionate, very balanced situation, making that choice to come, to heal the situation, which is a wish fulfillment, and starting anew. And that is what I have for all the water signs out there. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Also click that little bell on the side to get updated information. I do weeklies, dailies, monthlies. You guys have a great week and I'll talk to you soon.